Hello YouTube, this is going to be a really, really, really quick tutorial. Um, we're going to make a static plant today, and this is going to be the um, first of three different type of plant tutorials. So, yeah. <laughs> it, plants have a lot of... Um, there's many different types of plants you can make, so... Three, at least. <laughs> Anyways, um, today is basically going to be a static plant, so such as like a rose or a dandelion or a poppy, I guess in 1.7. So, um, all right, so plant, and I believe I called this one anethis or anith, anith or something like that. I don't know how it's pronounced. <laughs> Just seemed like the right thing to call it. All right, so plant. Okay, and we want this one right here, and we're going to select our texture, and we're going to hit next, and we're going to call it anyth, and hardness. I would just leave that. Um, Basically, how long it takes to destroy it. Resistance, how resistant it is to um, explosions. What it sounds like when it's, well, stepped on. <laughs> Not like you would squish a plant in Minecraft, but still. Uh, luminescence, um, how much light does it give off? It doesn't, no, well, if you wanted to, you could, but... <laughs> Um, frequency on chunks. I would bring that down a little bit. There, I tested it, and it was um, there was a lot. So, I would say probably a would be good, maybe. And does it drop itself? So, if you want it to have a custom block that or custom drop, you can set a custom drop to it. I'm not going to set a custom drop though. Drop amount, how many does it drop? Um, possibility of spawning with bone meal, I would just leave that as what it is there as well. Um, and then that's it, you just hit finish. <laughs> I'll see you in game. Alright, so we're in game. Let's go find this plant. Now this may take a while, I'm going to pause it here, and I'll find one. <laughs> Alright, that did not take long whatsoever. Um, <laughs> wasn't even worth pausing. Anyways, uh, this is what it looks like, and pretty much this is how frequent they spawn. They hardly spawn, but, you know, but, uh, I would say they spawn frequently, just not... Oh, here's a good example. You don't want it spawning more than dandelions, but you don't want it spawning too less either, I guess. So it, what we set it to was, uh, lag spike, uh, was just the right amount actually, because before uh, it was at 20, I think, was frequency on chunks. Now it was, it covered everything. Um, it was less than grass but more about 50 percent less than grass so yeah it, it wasn't good it wasn't good at all zombie villager um oh that's interesting look at that <laughs> anyways uh, that's it for this tutorial um, thanks for watching subscribe comment and uh, like